Oh, that's a good Brett Favre play, and Allison, who can't catch a cold during flu season, makes a play. What is going on, guys? We are back with another video. We're doing another one of our Madden Blast from the Past videos, and you can see Mike McCarthy, the old 2008 Packers. Now, this is a weird one because technically this is supposed to be the Jets, but also technically when Madden was out, he was still a Packer. I believe he was traded early August. So I didn't mention it, uh, forgot to sleaze, but maybe like and subscribe if you like these types of videos, and uh, let's get on with it. Some of those stats, the ratings might be a little off because it was the weirdest year for Madden for roster, especially a guy that was on the cover. So if you don't like certain things, if you don't get off my back, I'm touching butts. I'm just saying, I'm touching butts. But so we have Brett Favre here, I believe, as a 97 overall, which is weird because, you know, normally we've been doing 99 overalls. Not a terrible face model, almost looks like... Tom Brady-ish, kind of, but I believe he started the game as an 82, finished the game as a 94, which for Madden, that's really big in 08. He's 38, Superstar X Factor, of course. I know he's like 220, 225, but I didn't like the weight, like the, his body size just didn't look good to me, so I changed it. Some of the ratings, I once again, I'll touch butts if we have complaints, but some of the ratings might be a little off, but I based it a little bit off of what I wanted because there wasn't a definite rating set that I could have had unless I went got an Xbox 360 bought Madden 09 and I'm sorry but that is way too much effort I mean I could have the Xbox in my room right here with the game and I still think it might have been too much effort for me to put the game in <laughs> but this is uh Brett Favre with 99 toughness 99 injury obviously if you're gonna say one thing about him and you're the biggest hater in the world one positive thing is that he was a tank okay he was a tank we gave him 99 throw power wish I could give him 100 in game I believe he had 98 uh you know to start off the season he was poor they gave him like a 72 deep accuracy, like in the 80s for the rest. Of course, that changed once the season was over, because as we uh, know, you know, he did decently with the Jets, kind of considering the Jets in that status or status. And then the following year, the Vikings, he had probably his best season ever. So this is the far we're dealing with. If you want to fight me, I mean, I'll fight, okay? Bazooka, obviously. I mean, are you are you serious? Dashing dead eye, you know, I would try to work on what I wanted here. So uh while running outside the pocket has perfect accuracy. Roaming dead eye outside the pocket. What is this? On pressure throws outside the pocket while their feet are set. Clutch, I think, is very fair for him. Uh sideline dead eye was very fair. I was gonna put the other one. What was the other one? It was something with deep passing, but sideline dead eye was probably a little bit better. And then long range dead eye deep accuracy while feet are set so I really like the abilities we chose I think it makes a lot of sense and definitely not near the wide receiver caliber that the real life Brett Favre had to deal with uh, you know there was some really good receivers back then I wish I can give him 100 throw power because he really deserves it honestly even at that point in his career that age just a freaking talent and a half with with the strength uh, once again you know, take these with a grain of salt. It's supposed to be fun. I don't want to hear... Like, I had one of them where some guy was commenting on almost every single person's post. Saying, this guy doesn't know what he's talking about. He's got one or two overalls wrong on Adrian Peterson. I'm going to I'm gonna dis destroy his career. You know, like, fair enough. But, like, <laughs> could you not? Uh, so, you guys know that we usually like to make the playoffs when we do this. So... Maybe I come in here and force the last two. Oh, crap. It's on last two. It's one game. Uh, Brett Favre, 4,400 yards, 38 touchdowns, 14 picks. Not too far off of what he actually did. Aaron Jones, I don't really care too much about this stuff, but there's that. Was he a rookie? I don't know. I create. No, I didn't create him. I, uh, I used Mahomes. Sorry, Mahomes. I mean, can we have any more dome teams? Like, I would just, uh, I would just appreciate it so much. Is there even a single non dome team al alive? Oh god damn it. Are you joking me? Please tell me there's one team. Seattle's not going to get snow, does it? Well, be that as it may, this is a pretty good one because uh, Brett Favre was pretty horrible against the Cowboys in his career. All right, Favre never got to play, did he? When was this actually made? This is this stadium's actually probably pretty old by now. There's no way it was that recent, was it? Oh, wait, is that was it 2009? 
I was about to say, it was not no 2016. Get out of here with that. But, I I mean, Brett Favre, not great against the freaking Cowboys. I'll tell you what. There you go. Get old Favre in McCarthy. I really wanted this to be cold, you know? When you're really rich and your assistant comes back with a warm drink. You know, this works too. You know, it's not quite what I was hoping for, but it is what it is. Good old Bready the Jetty Favre. Once again, he's kind of, you know, on the... Oh, Jesus. I gave him a little sidearm because that's kind of what he was known for. And <laughs> almost almost threw what, what he was really known for as well. Yeah, the weapons around here are brutal. <laughs> They're just not good. Maybe a little too sidearm, but I mean... Oh, look at Devante go. There you go. Maybe a little too sidearm for my liking, but I mean, he did kind of have a little a hip thrust. That's the one thing I can say about his throw styles. Yeah, a hip thruster. I mean, in between, perfect. It is what it is. I wanted a hint of sidearm. I get a full freaking bar of sidearm. Oh, what a throw. I don't really know what to do for these style of players. You know, you got Adrian Peterson, breaks tackles. You have Devin Hester, super fast, avoids tackles. You know, Ray Lewis, he hits hard. But Favre just throws a football. <laughs> you know, like, what do we... I don't know, like, I don't know, like Peyton Manning, I guess you could even say that we highlighted his ability to audible quickly, catch people off guard, which was, it was actually pretty big, you know, it was a, it was a factor for sure, you know, it seemed like the defenders weren't really in perfect uh, situations when they, into double, not triple, Mercedes Lewis has been known to make some catches, giving some Brett Favre new school here, actually now we're gonna, we're gonna fake it, can I get a play action, nah, we can't do a play action. Damn it. Well, I was hoping there was that one ability, the last ditch. But I, I don't think I seen it. Rolling out unnecessarily. <laughs> oh, God. I mean, it had to be done, right? Like, it just, you know, throwing a ball that you just shouldn't throw because just because you can. It was like if we had that Peterson video without having a fumble. Like, it just, it you know, it needs to be done, okay? I really want to get Bazooka activated, though, at least once. When your fairness is not easy to activate. Oh, he's dead. How many do you actually have to get for Bazooka? Just one? All right, Devontae, just make a catch. Damn it. That's a Brett Favre stat line. Say what you want, but that's a stat line of his. There is not that much talent. That was a good play because he was in trouble. Good D by uh, Aaron Jones there, actually. Normally, I would say this video is not going how I'd expect it to, but nah, about as expected. <laughs> exactly how I expected, if we're being 100% uh, honest. Oh, that's a good Brett Favre play, and Allison, who can't catch a cold during flu season, makes a play. Honestly, Allison almost reminds me of, like, a James Jones. Like, James Jones was such a problem at catching early on in his career, and then he just became, like, the guy that could catch anything. It's about time. Oh my god, look at the bombage. Like he can he can deliver here. I just want one. I mean, I like the route. I just don't like the fact that Byron Jones is activated. Doesn't matter, though. Doesn't matter, though. And he catches it down to the two. So he has Bazooka. Have no idea how he gets knocked out of it. Probably throwing an interception. Ah! <laughs> Get away! This is actually so strugglesome. I knew our struggles in the red zone were bad, but holy crap. Did we just throw a corner fade to Mr. Devante? Left side, perfect, just like the history of the Aaron Rodgers. Oh, that was too easy. Okay, <laughs> it's going to leave him. I really wanted a jumper. Come on now. Okay, Devante. Let's see, can he hit the end zone from here? Well... That's not the end zone. Can we, like, I don't know, block? Maybe this time we'll actually get the time we want. That's not that long. It's a great catch, but, like, that, uh, I don't know. What? <laughs> what the hell is this? What do you mean? All right.
Oh, he took a sack. His bazook is gone. No. Oh, let's just call it how we see it. This offense is terrible. <laughs> this offense is not good. And I'm recording this after Rogers' gigantic game against the Raiders, so. It's just not a great set of skillful players. God damn it, Devontae. He's so good. Wish he was back. That's crazy. I mean, you look at this team with Devontae, and you're like, okay, I, I guess. But, you know, maybe if you were in, like, a coma. Are you for real? Maybe if you're in a coma for, like, the last, like, five years, and you're like, oh, Jimmy Graham? Okay, Packers finally got a tight end. And then you're like, yeah, that's not Jimmy Graham. That's some other dude that's in his skin. Are you for real? It's just picked off again. Yeah, this video is literally the Demarcus Lawrence video. But I will say, in fairness, another very realistic Brett Favre moment. I'm just saying. I'd say Bulaga is probably better than him now, at least this season. You know, David Bakhtiari with too many holding calls and whatnot. Just elementary stuff. There you go, Kumaro. Touchdown, Jesus. Back at it again. Oh, this, this outside lane would have been nice. Are you for real? Well, it wouldn't be a Brett Favre video without a fumble as well. Would a, wouldn't be a Brett Favre video without a costly turnover. But I thought Lane Vander Esch lost his abilities, no? Laser! Are you left-footed? Hurry up. Don't don't replay it because I definitely think he was out. Nope. Don't do it, Dallas. Damn it, Dallas. I mean, this has been an entertaining video. Ah, the game doesn't know any different. <laughs> Oh, the X-Factor ability. That's flawed. Okay, that's far, right? Look at him. He's he's in the zone. Pass interference. Pass interference. That's on you. That's on you, Byron. Your fault. Good old Green Bay getting the calls to go their way. <laughs> Gotta love it, don't you? Yeet! Jimmy, you have no feet. I want to hit Jimmy to the outside corner. I want to I wanna really test his throw power off. I want to see this corner. Yeah, Jimmy Graham drops the ball. Shocker. All right, Jimmy. Once again, you know, Brett Favre never really had that big target. Jimmy, you suck. Okay, you are just not good. There you go, Valdez. Fighting hard. Probably really dangerous because you're already over the line, but it happened. Okay, that was just a terrible route, but... It worked. You're slinging. You're still in the game. You know, just keep on slinging. Sometimes you gotta sling, right? I think Allison might burn for a score here. I don't know why. I just... Like, I don't think anyone's ever said that in their life, but I just feel like Allison's gonna burn for a score. There it is. There it is. Okay. <laughs> like I said, he's about, like, 14 speed. He's got, like, Jason Witten speed. We'll say Allison's consistently getting open. Still consistently slow as Witten. Time to look at Favre's ability to look off a screen. Oh, there we go. Aaron Jones. Oh, one to be. Oh, Aaron Jones is going to walk in. That's that's too easy. Too talented. Dives in and uh, easy as it gets, really. I think uh, Favre's got the throw power to get this into Adams. That's a good throw. Oh, that was an amazing throw. Absolute beaut. On a scale of 1 to 10, how angry would you guys have been if I would have spelled his name like F-A-R-V-E? Oh, classic Favre missing a wide open look. Dead eye, sideline, Aaron Jones, you should be ashamed of yourself. What a throw. And he holds on. on that's a Favre play. Going down, just throw it up. Give your guy a shot. You know we break in the NFL record. Kind of, because it is the playoffs. Perfect dime. Devontae scores like touchdown four or five. This has been the Devontae, Demarcus Lawrence, Brett Favre show. Third and four, up by three. Trying to keep the drive alive. This play, uh, we've seen it a couple times. It's not like I like it. I'm just going off of their choices. And there's a classic Favre as well. Not really open by any means. I mean, this is all pro. It's not easy. It's definitely not easy. I mean, imagine where we're thinking of Favre right now if he if he has those two Super Bowls that he probably should have won. Well, technically three. I mean, really, we're talking about a, a four Super Bowl man here. One with the Vikes, 
three with the pack. Like, oh, could you imagine? All right, throw off that about uh, that. Throw off that ability. What? Almost picked because Jimmy is a basically a six foot seven backboard. You throw it to him, and the ball just rebounds right off him. That throw power is deadly. Look at that left foot dig right into the dirt. Perfect. Play action, Devontae. Over the top of the linebacker. We're, we're going to see it. Perfect. Perfect. I really got to... Speaking of high points, though, I really got to use them more. I still think they're really good. It's really now about can your QB throw it. It's not really even about anything else. Really wish we had our ability, though. I haven't really had Bazooka much. It's not an easy ability to acquire, though, in fairness. We had him. There you go. Oh, that's a beaut. Oh, look at him. And there's a face mask on top of it. And we've seen several misses, so what do you want from me? What the hell is that? Couldn't do it. Come on, Jimmy. Could you, like, not suck? Once again, we'll play the realistic play here because I actually kind of want to see this game play out. 48 to 45 here. Are the Cowboys going to do it? Oh, no. We have ourselves a situation. 19 seconds, two timeouts with the Slanger. All right, fellas, this is this is GOAT status. Let's see. It's almost picked. God damn it. We should have waited a little longer. The worst part is that was an amazing play call. You got to have your best player going deep. Oh, there you go. MVS finds room. Go down. 22-yard line. Three seconds left. Really would have liked to be able to use that first time out, but it was almost intercepted. Oh, this is this is pretty legendary. Going to go for them corner looks. I think it's, it's a decent play call. I think you get Allison underneath. Let's get him inside, actually. Kumaro, Valdez, Scantling. I like it. I like it. And he misses the throw, does he? Who is, wh whose fault was that? Was it supposed to be an aggressive catch? I went with an aggressive, but I think it went rack. I got to see this final throw. He slanged the ball. He might have fumbled. He might have threw two picks, but he threw that rock, and he almost won in a shootout. You know, there was no you – know, the ground game would let him down, quote-unquote, because obviously we didn't really run the ball, but it was a fun one. I really liked this one a lot. Once again, I wanted to see this final throw, but they wouldn't let me do it, and I will not be able to see it. Oh, actually, will I? I did not know I would. No, uh, it was supposed to be an aggress. Damn it. I think I messed that up. I, I swear I pressed aggressive, but I must have hit rack. Ferris, he's still got to get that. He just reacts so late. But taking a look at the stats, far with 700 yards, six touchdowns, and two interceptions. Uh, completion percentage of 52%. I really wanted to get to 61 to 63, but I couldn't. Some of the missed throws and just overall drops. There's a lot of drops. Actually, was there? where's the drop category? Jimmy dropped three. Big shocker. One for Allison, one for Aaron, and one for Devontae. And honestly, the sideline ones where they couldn't keep their feet inbounds, I think that's a drop too, in my opinion. Like, if you can't secure the catch to get your feet down and that's why you miss, that's a drop. It's, it's simply put. Whether you actually catch it or not, you're bobbling it so you don't have possession, and that's the reason why you messed it up. Let's see who wins the Super Bowl just for the hell of it. This was a fun one. This was, this was good. Once again, let me know in the comment section below who you really want to see. Even if it's a peculiar one, you're like, you know what? I really want to see Eagles' Brian Westbrook. Be like, you know, that's actually a pretty good shot. He's kind of kind of a fun player. 42-27, to 27, Cowboys win over the Bills. Debretti, the Favre Jet. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. Retire, he did not. He regressed. What were the regressions? One throw power, 3D. I mean, that's not bad. He did drop like 10 overalls. That was like 9 overalls almost. It's still really good, though. But that's going to be the blast from the past. Brett Favre, if you really liked it, maybe like a video. Like a video. Okay. Like a video, and hopefully that video is this one. <laughs> Subscribe if you're new. We post one of these usually every week. We might have to post another one on, like, Saturday to make up for technically not posting one last week. But 
We have a lot of franchise. I try to sprinkle in a little ultimate team just for the ultimate team guys. And I, you know, I would prefer to do fran like if we're talking about what I would like to do with Madden, I'd prefer to do franchise, but I would like to do ultimate team. I would play it a lot more if people watch the videos. So I'm still gonna post those because I I do kind of like the mode, like the team building aspect, but it's not gonna be as often as franchise, obviously. Maybe we'll throw more superstar KO. I don't know. But anyways, biggest thing, if you you, know, you don't sub, you don't like, the biggest thing, comment who you want to see. And once again, I might not respond to every comment because these ones usually get a lot more comments than usual. But no, as usual, I am always looking. I am always watching. Close your blinds. Otherwise, I'm, I'm probably in the tree looking through your window. Anyways, hope you guys come back for the next video. But until next video, see ya!